and welcome to Life in Envelopes. I am Jennifer Bleacher. This channel is all about planning, budgeting, paying off debt, and hopefully one day retiring early. So if those are topics that you are also interested in, then please subscribe to my channel. Okay, it is time for cash envelope stuffing. Yay! <laughs> I absolutely love this time of the month. I get to do it twice a month because my money grows. I get to count money. <laughs> I like counting money. And um, it's like a big security blanket for me. So I just absolutely love doing it. I just want to quickly go over the worksheets that I use to do the background work before I make my videos. I have a sinking funds overview worksheet. By the way, all these worksheets are available in my Etsy shop, Life in Envelopes. There is a link down in the description box below, along with a 15% off coupon for all of my YouTube viewers. So I use the sinking funds overview, um, sinking funds amount to withdraw from the bank. This is where I calculate how much I need of each denomination. And then I fill out this bank slip that I take to the bank with me. Cash envelope stuffing, sinking funds and cash envelopes. I actually do this in my Erin Condren little notebook here now. Um, this is $16 from Erin Condren. It's just a notebook. And, um, I do have an affiliated link to Erin Condren in the description box below as well. So feel free to use that. And if you're a first time buyer with her, you get $10 off. That's pretty exciting. Then I also have sinking funds tracker by category and cash envelope tracker by category. So those are all available in my Etsy shop as printable. So you can buy them once and then print them off and use them over and over again. Okay, I always have this off to the side while I'm doing my work so I can look back at it and make sure that I'm doing the right amount. But if you've watched my videos, you know I often make mistakes <laughs> even when I have this off to the side. Okay, let's get the notebook set up. I have this sinking funds kit from my Etsy shop. This is Fall Dahlia sinking funds 7x9. I also have an 85 half by 11 kit available. And then I have some custom category stickers. This is also an option on my Etsy shop if you'd like to order custom stickers. I just fit as many as I can on a page for you when, when you pl place your order. It's $5 a page. So in this particular case, I was able to make, see this This would be a whole, whole page. I cut it in half, but I was able to make eight stickers for myself. So just as an example. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and play some nice music for you while I get this all set up. I'll be back in a few seconds. Okay, let's get the money set up. This is just a little planner that I use to um, hold my spending money and anytime I need to deposit money into the bank or I'm withdrawing money from the bank, I take this with me. So, this is a withdrawal. <laughs> so I'm gonna just go ahead and get these all set up and then we will get started. Okay, our first category is Christmas. By the way, these envelopes are also available in my Etsy shop. I have three different kinds of envelopes. I have the, these neutrals, clear, and pattern envelopes. Okay, so I like to just count how much I have to start with and write that down. I'm usually more accurate if I do it that way. <laughs> so let's do that together. One, two, three, 350, four, 405, 410. So we currently have 410 in our Christmas and today we are going to add $50. So we will have a new total of $460. Is that right? Yep, that's right. So 20, 40, 50. And then I like to put them in order from um, smallest to biggest. It just makes it counting a lot easier. 1, 2, 3, 350, 4, 420, 440, 450. Oh, I messed up already, you guys. <laughs> I don't add 50. That's how much I add over the month total. But today I'm only adding 25. I was hoping to have a video with no mistakes, but what fun is that? Okay, so we're gonna add 25, and then we should have a total of 435. Okay, so let me take away 25, 
Oh shoot. Okay, I'm gonna take away the 50 because I had added a 10. So, okay, put the 50 back. Now I'm gonna take 25. 25. Whew. Okay, now let's count and make sure I have 435. 1, 2, 3, 354, 420, 425, 430, 435. Okay, <laughs> we got the first envelope done. <laughs> Please don't log off. <laughs> I will try to do better. Okay, birthdays. Um, we, my oldest son recently turned 18 and we cleared out the envelope for him. So we currently have zero, whoops, zero to start with. And today we are going to add 25. So today we will end with 25. 20 and five. Okay, next up is our anniversary. And let's see how much we have to start. 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. So we have 40 to start. And then today we're going to add $5 for a total of $45. 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. car maintenance and let's see how much we have to start 1 20 130 and today we're going to add 10 for a total of 140 One twenty, one thirty, one forty. Next is our back to school. Let's see how much we have to start. Ten twenty. We don't have very much because we recently just paid all of our back to school expenses. We're going to add ten today for a total of 30. 120, 140, 160. And we are going to add 20 today for a total of 180. Twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, one, one twenty, one forty, one sixty, one eighty. 140, 160, 80, 180. Next is Amazon. This is for our annual fee, which is just a little over $100. Let's see how much we have to start with. 20, 40, 45, 50, 55. And today we're going to add five for a total of 60. 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. Next we have car registration. This is pretty heavy. <laughs> Let's see how much is in here. Oh my goodness, look at this. This is a, this is a big one. One, 120, 130, 140, 150, 160, 170, 175, 180, 185, 190, 195, 200, 205. 
So we have 205 to start with. And today we are going to add 15. So that will bring us to 220. One, 120, 130, 140, 150, 160, 170, 180, 185, 190, 195, 200, 205, 210, 215, 220. Yay, it worked out. I did not make a mistake on that big, huge envelope. Okay, next we have vitamins. These are vitamins that I take and I have to refill them. I refill them, I buy them in bulk every six months. So it's cheaper that way, but, but it's a big cost when it, when it does happen. 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. And today we're going to add $10. So I should now have a total of $110. Fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, one hundred, one ten. Next is our emergency fund. This is um, an emergency fund to refill our emergency fund when we do have to use it one day. 1, 120, 140, 160, 180, 180. And today we're going to add And today we're going to add $20 for a total of 200. 1, 120, 140, 160, 180, 200. Next, we have clothes. This is just for my youngest son. Um, the rest of the family, we're trying not to buy clothes in an effort to save money to pay off our debt. But kind of hard you guys. <laughs> I kind of wish I had a little bit of money to spend to buy some clothes for myself so I don't know. Okay clothes 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 and today we're going to add 10 for a total of 70. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. I was actually thinking if I can figure out like my budget for um, my Etsy shop and my YouTube, like if I can get all my like small business stuff figured out, because right now I'm not doing a very good job financially on that side, like figuring that out. If I could figure that out, maybe I could start paying myself a little bit each month and then I could have money for things like clothes if I want them or if I want to take my youngest son out, out for Fun Friday, you know, things like that. So something I'm thinking about, stay tuned, I've actually ordered a product from Plum Paper to help me um, get my, finance, my finances organized, so that will be coming in the future. Okay, next up we have David's Meds. This is, so we do have insurance for David, but one of his prescriptions, even with insurance, is quite pricey. It's $260 every six months, so we um, started saving up for that. 20, 40, 60, 80. So we're starting with 80. And we're going to add $20 today for a total of 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Okay, we have a new category, extra week. This is our solution for, um, so we get each get paid once a month and whether it's a four week month or a five week month, we always have the same amount of money to work with. Well, we have an extra week of groceries in that if there's a five week month. So we 
have decided to start putting away money every um, sinking fund period to, to have money for the groceries when those five week months happen. So let's see, I actually started it uh, last time and I think we have 50 in here. Let me double check. I just love this old 20. I think that's so cool. 20, 40, 50. Yes. So we're starting with 50 today and we're going to add 50 more, which brings our total to 100. Our weekly budget for groceries is 195. So we're already halfway to having an, uh, money for an extra week there. So $50. 20, 40, 50, put this together, should be 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100. This is very exciting, you guys, because that, that extra week kept throwing our budget off. It was, it was painful, so I'm very excited to have this now. Okay, so let's see how much we had. Oh, wait, I have more money here. <laughs> That is my spending money. Notice I haven't spent my spending money yet. Wait, or did I? Oh, no, yeah, I still have my spending money from last time. Yay, I didn't spend it. I like it when I'm able to save my spending money because then I can buy things like clothes, <laughs> like I was just saying. Okay, let's see how much we had to start with. Okay, we started with $14.90. We had a little bit more last time. We had 1580. We took out 100 um, from birthdays for my son's birthday, and I actually took out money from Christmas because I bought a couple of Christmas gifts, so that's why our starting balance, um, balance is lower. Okay, so let's see how much we deposited today. Okay, we deposited $225 today. So if we add these two numbers together, that would be 1715. So we're going to, so now this is how I double check to make sure I did it right. Now I'm gonna add all these together and fingers crossed it equals 1715. Yay! <laughs> okay, so that's like how often I make mistakes. By how excited I get when I do it right, you know that I make a lot of mistakes. <laughs> Okay, so 1715. Oh my goodness. We are almost to $2,000 in our sinking funds. It's amazing. Okay, friends, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, then please give it a thumbs up, and I will see you again next time. Bye, everyone.